For the first time in the country's electoral history, election campaigns are being held devoid of political rallies due to the COVID-19 pandemic. And several political parties taking part in the August 12th general election have continued with their different strategies to reach out to the electorate away from the usual political gatherings. Three of the 16 political parties say campaigning without holding massive gatherings has not in any way affected them. PF Lusaka Province Deputy Presidential Campaign Coordinator Mumbipiri says the party already campaigned through the development projects it has delivered. And hence we expect a high number of votes for the president. And for me, who has gone round, especially in Lusaka, I can say, comfortably say, the president, Dr. Edikwa Chagwalungu, is winning this election with not less than 70% of the votes. And mark my words, because I've been able to talk to the people on one-to-one. -one. The opposition UPND is also confident of scooping the presidential seat, saying the party has used unique methods of campaigning to reach out to its supporters. But as UPND, we are confident that we are winning, we are winning this election. <clears throat> Look, we're coming from very far. UBND has continued, has continued campaigning from the time of its inception, even at the time that the people were laughing that you've lost elections. To us, that wasn't a loss of UBND, but it was a loss of the country. It is a country that, lo that lost a government that was going to ensure that Kaiser was going to bring peace and love. Democratic Party Vice President Judith Kabemba has also expressed confidence that the party leader, Hari Kalaba, will carry the day on August 12. I must speak very confidently that come 12th August, President Harry Kalaba will emerge as a new Republican president to take over from where His Excellency uh, President uh, Lungu has, uh, has ended. The country goes to the polls on August 12, 2021, when the electorate will exercise the right to vote for leaders in various elective positions. Mark Zivigone, ZNBC News, Lusaka. Process. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like, leave a comment, and subscribe.